Anyone see me in here? Robots are not currently active. Whoa. Right. That's you. Forgot about that. Uh, they can't get me where I am right now. Or even know where I am right now. This camera's still an issue, though. There we go. Beep. Right here? Hello. What is it orange you need? Alright, let's turn all this stuff off. No. Alright, well this is cool. I basically found exactly what I was hoping to find. A K L V D six 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 A one. Is that the same code as before? Oopsie. A K L V D six six eight one. Why don't you work? What's going on? Oopsie. A K L V B D six six A one. Why are you lying to me? You're lying to me. That's not the code that was in the email, is it? Why are you lying to me? That's never happened before. P three four T four five W F. P three four T four five W F. P three four T four five. WF P three four Oopsie P three four T four five WF is that right? P three four T four five WF Damn it P three four P three four T four five WF uh shit P three four T four five WF P three four T four five WF what? Is that what I typed in? The fuck? Is it you? You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. I have tools. Tired of your bullshit with this thing where you tell me a password and it doesn't work. Unless I, unless I was typing it wrong, in which case I'll feel silly. Whoa! Sorry. I had caps lock on from the password thing, because I, when I typed in the password to try to see if ta caps was the secret. And when I t pressed caps lock to turn it back off, it decided that the game was going to go into keyboard mode. And it stopped me in the process of hacking. Thank you. Cameras? Nope. Why can't I turn you off? Oh, it was already off. Okay. You already turned off. You're open. There we go. Deploy these guys. How do I lasers? How do I lasers? Lasers are not on the list of things. That's weird, right? You can also open and close the door. Probably don't want people to see that. Oh, right. Moving the door automatically changes the uh, setting of the thing. Okay. Let's take a look around in here, huh? Maybe we'll find a VIP card that gives you normal access to this place. Then I can be here legit. Neuropazine! Jesus, it's everywhere. You... Ever people, this is a fucked up society. People are like constantly struggling to have neuropathy and they're not surviving. And I'm like just finding it everywhere, and I'm the only person who doesn't even need it. And I'm like just finding it left and right like it's no big deal. And we're keeping it from all the people that need it. So it stayed open. Yeah, yeah. As as was explained by the uh, security thing we read, if the door opens and closes, the uh, things retract. So as long as I don't do that again, we should be good. You should be easy to hack. Confirmed. Easiness to hack. Actually, maybe not that easy to hack. Crap. That was last second. Oh, I might not make it in time. Oh, no. Oh, got it. Cool. I was, didn't really want to spend an extra one. And I didn't have to. Let's go back to my gun. Just because holding that thing out the whole time feels weird. Although I could have just put it away. Don't question me. Oh, another one. That's not convenient. And some more credits. Uh, otherwise kind of underwhelming contents for this particular locker, to be honest. Alright. One last scan of the room. Doesn't seem like there's much going on around here. Any weird stuff? No vents? 
Advance outside, that's the one I came in from. Alright, so if I stay out of the path of lasers, I'm good. How do I, I close you back up? Eh, you'll close on your own, I'm sure. Just updating my save before, before I accidentally this triple laser and make this all bad for myself. So I should be able to use these lockers without the lasers being a problem. Alright, and I could be, I could uh, cloak through you. There we go. Don't have the code for you, don't necessarily care. Um, how do I get to you? That's a bit roundabout, isn't it? We'll have to go this way to go there, so I might as well start by going here. Sure. Let's use stealth. That'll give me a nice head start, perhaps. Quickly now, don't want to get in trouble. Just overclock this shit. Go, 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 go. Oh, we're getting a little close now. There we go. A little tense. A little tense. What do you got? One Praxis kit. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. Alright. Just be careful here. Just don't want to walk in front of these things. I assume that all the ones that are unlocked are empty, but I'll still check. Because I can. Oh, there's lasers inside the hallways too. They're everywhere. Alright. Just watching out. Good thing I can see them. Like magic. Don't know the code for you either, but for some reason you're the you're the low security one. I don't know why there's low security ones, but okay. Uh, this is the route I gotta go if I want to get inside this path. Oh crap, that's not actually accurate. I need to go this way. Because I need to grab this one on the way in or I'll get trapped. Didn't watch the arrows correctly at first. Oh wow, I haven't been caught yet. It's a surprise. Wow, still not caught. Hacking everything! <laughs> Regret nothing. More multi-tools and a breach software. How far along am I on those? They're like the collectible of this game. I have 11 out of 30. Uh, they have something to do with the breach game. I literally don't know what breach is yet. <laughs> it's on the main menu of the game next to Jensen Stories, which is which Jensen Stories is where you, how you access DLC and stuff like that. I have no clue what breach is still. I just don't know. So we'll see. Maybe it's crap. Maybe it's interesting. Those are both empty. I'll check anyway. The important thing is I found a Praxis kit. That's a pretty good start. And a few other things along the way. No laser here? Okay. Yep, still empty. Hey there. Hey, we know a code for this guy. Oopsie. Uh... How do I backspace? There we go. I was pressing A on it to then start typing the password because that's how the computers usually work. But have forgot about how safes work. That's one of them was only 15. Those are very all over the place values of uh, credits. I do love that I can just magically you know, go invisible and, and skip the whole laser problem. Although I could just jump over it, but I mean. Then I could screw that up. We want, wouldn't want to have that happen, except for all the people who like to watch me fail. Hello. Laser going th through the middle of the room. I think that's it then, right? That's every vault. I think I checked all of them. Alright. Another heist well done, Jensen. We've had a great time slowly robbing the Palisade Bank of everything that uh, it holds dear. And that's been a great time for me. So, I'm glad we could all be a part of this together. Get the door open. And nobody suspects a thing, right? Alright, what's this room over here? What is this room? Executive services. What's in here? There's a computer. Have I been in here yet? It looks like a... Oh yeah, there's, there's a... I think I just hacked this room a moment ago. I sure did. Alright, we're, we're done with that. All right, it's been an eventful day at Palisade Bank, and uh, we'll see how soon they realize how eventful today's been. I'm not gonna tell them. You probably shouldn't tell them either, just just a pro tip, really. You having a good time, buddy? You guys having a good time? You having a good time? 
You having a good time? Yeah, that's the proper emotion for the situation, honestly. It's okay, I'm sure he'll get better soon, ma'am. Or the robots over here will execute him, I don't know. We've made a ruckus around here, frankly. All these goddamn windows are broken everywhere, like, look at that. No one's even acknowledging him anymore, but there's robots deployed everywhere. There's a turret. There's broken windows everywhere. It's kind of spooky. Let's go ahead and take the next step with my cloaking duration. There we go. Now it's nice and optimized. And on that topic... Let's see, what do I want to make with, with these things? I could make more, uh... uh make more biocells, right? Uh, let's maybe wait for us to get low on some of these things. I don't want to start making multiple stacks of these things. Eh, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Anyway. Rich man, poor Og. An anonymous pocket secretary from Kazatel contained a message from the Palisade Bank talking about someone with plenty of money, but no love for Ogs. They live in the rich apartment above the rabbit in Sisti. Maybe it's time they be a better person and give some charity to a needy non-natural. And that's right outside Palisade Bank. Look at these structures, by the way. I mean, that's a really bizarre rendering of the uh, water effect, but the structures still look cool. Hello, what, what, what? 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 What, where do you go? I'm sorry. I'm rather distracted by the weird freaking vent here. It probably just goes to the underground parking structure garage. Yeah, this is just the area that leads me to the Palisade, Palisade Bank. Well, that's neat. <laughs> what a bizarre hiding place for another vent. <laughs> the top of the fountain? Can I hop back up there? Yep. Love my hyper jump. Always grab that practically first for all future... Basically all future uh, Deus Ex playthroughs, I'm gonna... Hyper jump's gonna be like the first thing I grab just because... Not being able to jump... Oh, not being able to jump on something is kind of the most frustrating thing in the world. Can you get on top of this guy? Hip? The answer is yes. The answer is yes I can. So suck it, world. In fact, I can probably get to that structure over there. I really nail it! Aha! Take that, suicide sign. I jumped on you from without dying from ball falling on buildings. What am I saying? Anyway, that's apparently the window of the guy I'm checking out, so that's, uh... Coincidental? That's not very high resolution, is it? <laughs> not supposed to see it this close up. So that is the room of the guy that we're supposed to deal with. Alright, let's see. I'm alive. For the moment. Is this his room, or is this just some place? So what I'm learning here is that uh, Jensen is that asshole from across the street who has the same remote uh, control uh, frequency as you and keeps turning off your television and changing the channels and stuff. Um... That didn't work. Didn't, that did not work. I think the cops are gonna get mad at me now. I didn't know if I could break the window or not. Thought I'd give it a shot. I just thought it'd be really cool if I randomly jumped on a window like this and that actually got me in. But I don't think that's gonna pan out that way, honestly. If I were to wager at this point, I just jumped wrong. People are hostile to me, although they don't seem to know where I am, because I'm in a really weird part of the level right now. What do you do by coming up here? Oh, so these guys have a terrible view. Their windows are all blocked by this nonsense. I'm probably going to get in trouble here. Yep, that's where this is going. <laughs> that's exactly where this is going. Okay, so maybe this wasn't the best access to this part, but I'm curious where else I can give me access to. Hip. And this one is interesting, right? If I grab it successfully. Anyone in here? Not the moment. Trailblazer! That's a big chunk of experience right there. There's some beer. Just curious. Not a high detail apartment so far. Lots of alcohol. And I got a lot of space for alcohol right now, so it's not a crazy idea to just start grabbing some of it. Oh, I started taking all of those shots. Whoops. 
Wedding photograph. Wedding photograph belonging to a woman named Stana Tomasek. There is a date written on it in reverse. May 2020. Is this an Easter egg for a real person or is this a reference to a quest thing? I guess we'll see. May 2020. Alright. I was a little better when I could see straight. <laughs> hey there. Grab a few of those. I'm just curious to see if there's like a weird secret compartment or something around here. Perhaps not. Ah. I'm remote turning it off. I really just wanted to walk up to it and turn it off, but that's fine. Uh, let's go hacking into some random person's computer, because apparently I'm a dick. <laughs> Oh no! Trace program Surprise initiated. reveal! Access denied. Oh no, they actually really got me that time. Oh, No one likes waiting. Tell me your secrets photograph. I have time now, I have time. A lot of alcohol I can't take, surprisingly. What's over here? Windows to the same apartment. Uh, rooftop access. That's not getting me anywhere unless I really want to jump on top of that. Which actually, actually, I don't think I'd make the jump. Nah, there's not a lot else going on out here. It's pretty much just one balcony, but it's a really remote location for a balcony. I think the only way to get here is the route I took. Which is pretty remote. That's why I don't, it doesn't seem entirely crazy that maybe there's, there could be like a... Uh, there could, it could be like an Easter egg of some kind. Access granted. I mean, that time around, I knew where the firewalls were, so I just ignored. I just went around them that time. Attention required. Expired account. Dear Mrs. Uh, Tomasek, our deepest sympathies of the news of your late husband. In la oh, so he's dead. Yay! That's happy. Well, that's too bad. Uh, in light of Mr. Tomasek's legal death, as per the attorney's letter, his, his account and corresponding vault allocation at the Palisade Property Bank is hereby released to you as next of kin. We must ask you to collect the vault contents using the code 1305, so I, which I've already opened now because I took all of them, uh, either in person or through authorized representation before the space can be allocated to another customer. Due to the extenuating circumstances, the bank has decided to extend the collection and closure period, but would still ask you to attend this matter within 14 days. If, after this period, you have not or are unable to undertake these instructions, the contents of your account will be securely destroyed as per sign agreement and guarantee of the Palisade Property Bank under the regulations and established protocols managing expired or closed accounts. Further details are available on a request. Please, us, please let us know if there's something we can do to help. Yours faithfully. Thomas Romanek. So they destroy your contents, or maybe that's just the specific agreement that this person chose, in, chose to enter into. Uh, feeling down today. Response to Wendy Hever... Let's see, this is... Uh, from uh, Stana Tomasek to Wendy Heffern. My dearest Wendy, I've been trying to move on, keeping busy like you advised, and for the most part, I think I've been doing okay, but today, the clouds uh, gathered around me again. It's, it's out, it's typo. It's our wedding anniversary today, and I find myself sitting here alone, surrounded by so many memories, the good and the bad. I'm sorry, I don't really know why I'm writing this. I just can't help thinking that it was my fault for pushing him to go work there in the first place. He wanted contract work in the Middle East, but I thought our opportunity sounded better. I'm such an awful person, Wendy. Stana. Stana, no you're not. I am so proud of you. I know losing Selvan was hard, especially considering the circumstances, but you have to keep reminding yourself that there was nothing you could have done. He was killed by a very sick man, Stana, just like uh, like my Charlie and my niece Clara, like millions of people. The only ones to blame are those bastards at Darrow Industries. Look, I know it's hard. I deal with Charlie's memory every day, but I accept that uh, that this is where he is now, in his memories, and I cherish all of them. You need to start doing the same. The past should stay where it is. Move on, Stana. Selvin will live on further in your heart, forever in your heart. Stay strong, you'll make it, Wendy. Now here's the part where I try to search my mind, my mind for names and dates and try to piece this together. But wouldn't that if they're blaming it on Dara, wouldn't it have to be the Og incident that everybody died from? So I that means that those two weeks are up. 
this uh, expired account. Assuming that this was, hap assuming this happened because of his death, then all of these emails are years ago, and this place has just been sitting here all this time. Unless it took a long time to expire, but it sounds like it expired because he died, and it sounds like he died. <clears throat> sounds like he died from the Og incident, didn't he? Maybe I'm misattaching certain elements of the history here. From Hemingway's Fine Spirits to Stana Tomasek. And, and they've got a face, Hemingway. Well, it's because I think it's a store I can visit. Uh, Mrs. Tomasek, I see that there is another two cases of Risling here awaiting... Uh, here for you awaiting delivery, and we have yet to receive payment for the last co uh, consignment. I'm not sure what the alcohol is for, but... I almost feel compelled to suggest you might perhaps order less if you cannot keep up payments on such a high volume. I should remind you that we are not a wholesaler and this alcohol is not to be resold under any circumstances. We deal with a small artisanal winery and part of that deal is that we respect the produ uh, producer's wish wishes for limited propagation of their product. You'll forgive me if I preempt any requests for credit. I am a small business, Miss, Mrs. Tomasek, so I hope you understand that it's not something I can afford to offer. I await your payment and wish you well. Respectfully, Alma Caps, Al Alma Capiz, or something like that, owner, Hemingway's Fine Spirits. Makes me want to visit that store. I don't think I've visited it yet. Maybe meet the, with the, with the string of stuff we've been doing right now, I might as well meet the NPC just to attach the story to a face. But that's pretty dark that this person in the uh, aftermath of the death of their husband, she was drinking so much that the person super... Whoa, is that floating? Oh, it's a freaky table, never mind. Super electromagnetic fields. It's uh, depressing that this person was so depressed and drinking so much that she ended up in a situation where uh, she's drinking so much alcohol that they think that she's selling it to people. But you can see it in this room, it's just everywhere, because she's just... She just went into the depths of that. But she's not home right now. The biggest upside, I could say, is that there's no body in here. Unlike some of the rooms we've checked out. Just a lot of alcohol, a lot of chips, some alcohol on the floor, which is not a good sign. But actually, I mean, all things considered, this is actually one of the tight- this is tidier than most actual apartments. Despite- even if it is- like, I don't know if it's actually meant to, be, to look disheveled at all. So she's a tidy alcoholic, aside from the part where she needs to dispose of her bottles, but even those are mostly on tables. <laughs> her floor's pretty clear, is basically what I'm saying. I wonder if I can locate this winery on the map. Ludovic's Lounge, we're looking for Hemingway. Stenex. I want to find Hemingway's winery. Hemingway's Fine Spirits. Alright, can I set... I can't say it waypoints in this game, can I? Ah, fine. I'll just hop down and, look and turn left. Hip! Don't get spooked, guys. I'm just hopping down like a crazy lunatic. It's just what we do. We augments, because we're better than you and have superpowers. But don't get racist against us right now, because, um... I got a job to do? But I can't explain to you who I'm working for, or who I'm helping, or what any of it's for. So really, this whole thing's really suspicious, honestly. Um, take my word for it? What the hell? What's this do? I'm sorry, what happens if I deactivate a car? What did I just do? <laughs> Does it, it turn off the alarm if I jump on it, basically? I was just kind of curious what would happen if I... <laughs> I'm like, what does that mean, deactivate car? Do we ever see them driving around? Hemingway's fine spirits. Right. It's nighttime, so she's not here. But this is the location. That's where the alcohol's coming from. Looks like a detailed place. Uh, maybe I'll come back later. I don't know. You snoring? There's a basement or a... It's probably a basement. Most of these buildings have basements. That's too bad that she's not here right now. Kind of wanted to... Put a name to a face. Alright, we'll see. Maybe after I do the next main story mission, it'll become daytime? Anyway, she was up there on that ledge. That's my goal, apparently, up there, but the window approach didn't really work out. 
I couldn't really punch through it properly with what I was trying to use, and it created a big old disturbance, so we're going to try not to do that again. There's a vent here, which I may or may not have already explored in the past. I mean, it's already open, so the answer is probably yes. It seems to go down instead of up, though. Might even go to the sewers or something. Alternatively, there's this business. Is that a magic shop? There's a magic shop. Well, this is a site. We have top hats, we have magic books, we have gauntlets. Yeah. Okay. Not on the list of store types I was expecting to encounter, honestly. Cards. This is elixirs, I think. What's that say? Hulky? What would those be? Just wood? I actually don't know what some of this stuff's supposed to be. Is that those candles? Oh my god. You actually enter into a dialogue with it. I cannot be certain. What? 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 That's a massive ripoff. You wouldn't even, like, you didn't even try to play it up or anything. You're just like, I cannot be certain. Took my money. You took my money. That was a fourth of, like, a practice kit or some nonsense like that. Screw that guy. Welcome to Magia. Yeah, welcome to Magia. I can help you with something, yes? Yeah, I think so, but we can't talk to each other, apparently. Would you like to have a I conversation? Can help you with something, yes? Can we have a conversation, please? Apparently not. Weird. Anyway, hip. Gonna go up here now. There is nothing for you there. Yeah, maybe. Oh, I've been down here before. Look at this place. There's some wine. Yeah, I've totally looted this entire area before. S small town, huh? <laughs> Slowly ruining everyone's lives. What's with this creepy room, though? Is this, is this one? Does medical boxes? Creepy uh, names. Bunch of circuits set up. Does he do illegal surgeries down here or something? Seems like he might be. Yeah, especially since this was blocking the door, he might be doing illegal augment stuff down here. Is he augmented? He does not appear to be augmented. Welcome to Magia. Welcome to Magia, he says, and that's it. We might not get the interesting results of that of being here that I, that I thought we would. That's too bad. All right. Need an alternate way up top then. Used to be if I can get on that roof, we're good. Um, is there Sir, some creative platforming to be done? Oh, right over there. If I get on top of this thing, we're good. So, can I stand on you? Oh, yeah. Oops. You're surprisingly durable. Alright. Now we're up here. I might be able to make that work. Perhaps. Huh. There we go. Alright, yeah. Just Tarzaned onto this roof, didn't I? Hi. I'm in your house now. Don't freak out. I'm just gonna read this book on your table right now, right? The Long Meanwhile, Chapter 27, by Daniel Fletcher. There was a pause. Are you sure? Am I sure? I always double check. I've run a few simulations and it just destroys everything in its path. Thousands of people could die if we don't get the package back. Run it again, Smiley, then tell Miller. Delara came back in, a and back in and sat on my dark leather couch. Who is that? She asked. Ah, Agent Jensen. You work too much, Daniel. It's important, I said, restarting the simulation again. But the simulation will take a few hours to complete, so you have my undivided attention. Oh, I do, do I? I sat down on the, on the couch next to her, leaning in and said, Karaoke? Her eyes popped wide, and she smiled. You always know just what to say, don't you? Yeah, Fletcher just straight up has, like, fiction, but he has, like, a fan fiction of his own life. And it's... 
kind of distressing how it's propagating the role of society because it's supposed to, we're supposed to be a secret organization. Seems like that's like the biggest security risk of them all, honestly. Whoa, graffiti, look at that. Oh, it's the, it's the falling man again. Is those... What's going on over there? Someone's taking AUG signs and they're hiding them on a roof over there. Oh, that looks interesting. Let's remember that for a moment. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to that in a moment, alright? Because that looks interesting, whatever the hell's over there. This goddamn town is so freaking detailed in weird little ways. Like, I know people complain there's only one hub world in this game, but damn. The details everywhere are, are appreciated. Alright. Don't mind me just super jumping. You're all just called civilians? Oh, you're not my objective. That's just a thing I can turn off. Why bother me? Go bother someone else. Right. Sorry. It looks so much like a quest objective. My mistake. There's a multi-tool. This is somebody's house, right? Why is... Like, you guys live here, don't you? Someone... Do none of you guys live here? How'd you get how'd you get up here otherwise? There's no There's no roof access. You only could have gotten here through this apartment. And none of them care that I'm just wandering in, which they seems like they should. Oh well, I'm gonna sell all your beer. Don't mind me. And your cred chips and your painkillers you might need for actual pain. I, I don't care. I'm Adam Jensen. I'm here for a mission. So I'm gonna loot the entire town. Crafting parts for the supply. Alright, TV is off. We are ready to get reading, huh? Let's get started. It's only rank 3. I'm sure I'm fine. Uh, good luck, me. That's not good. That's not good. And we're fine. <laughs> Test results. From Dr. Otej Strant to Oleg Drago. Dear Mr. Drago, the tests have come back negative, and as far as I am concerned, this eliminates all other explanations. It is my formal diagnosis that your headaches are caused by your neural augmentation. This is potentially very serious, but not something I can treat. My advice is to approach an authorized augmentation specialist through one of the main Prague hospitals and have it fully scanned even though they will be required to register your augmentation. Please let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. So we just found out that Mr. Drago, or Drago, has a, uh, has an augmentation, which he's apparently trying to keep secret. Whoopsie. Blackmail. Mr. Drago, or Drago, Drakink Drzinskio, from, uh, Thomas Romanek. Uh, I am pleased to inform you that the security checks in your new account have been cleared. This, of course, means access to your VIP services, including use of the vault assigned to your account, will be ready within three business days. In the meantime, you can bring in your biometric identification on the data disk we provided and prevent me, uh, present it to me in person so that we may present you with your client access card. I look forward to meeting you finally in person. Yours faithfully. And then... Stock alert from Vera Nakon, uh, Nakoneshki, or something like that. Oleg, sorry to hear you're not feeling great, but thumbs up for private medical at least. I uh, just wanted to give you a heads up before you come in tomorrow that we have a new mandate to liquidate all our clients' stock at Kondal Securities by the end of the week. The board just learned that they still sell insurance to OGS, and it's causing ripples. Surprise, surprise. Dirty handsers are even depressing the markets, for God's sake. Hope you're better tomorrow, buddy. Vera Narkoneshki, or something along those lines? Alright, got a little more experience along the way. And hopefully got what we were looking for. Are we done with that? Let's see. Something mysterious in Prague. Are we done with the... Seems like that just kind of ended. What happened to the other quest? Um, I don't know if that's going anywhere honest, else, honestly. Huh. Did it just kind of end on us? That's it? If 
Find out some information, but no particular suggestion to take it somewhere. Place admittedly seems pretty empty. Warriors failed to see the bigger picture. The AUG incident threw everything off the rails. Since then, it's surprisingly in sync, the animation and everything. Alright, well, I'm curious about this thing over here, so we're gonna do that next. Ta-da! Don't be startled, it's just me, Super Jensen! 